exactly. <laughs> Case in point. Dang, that looks hard though. I don't know how you beat that. I think you gotta just beat it. Like, uh, like <laughs> yeah, no, no, like you got, like yeah, you gotta, like outrun it, like as in a race. How, the way you beat it is that you beat it. <laughs> I get it. You just gotta avoid losing, dude. Yeah. Duh. You just have to achieve the objective that the game or that the designer created. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. I totally fucking got this. Oh, I see. It's see? not that I'm hard. A genius. It's not that hard. And then I got the red gems. Now that even. you did it, I'm like, oh, it's not cool that you did it. Whatever, I did it in one. In, oh, oh what? what happened? It was a sticky D-pad, man. <laughs> sticky D-pad. Isn't it always, dude? You know what? I am like seriously considering buying a Wii U or or a Switch. Oh yeah. Just to play that Breath of the Wild, man. The Zelda game, huh? Yeah, yeah. I have not played a Zelda game since uh, Link to the Past, man. Wow, man. Like I wanna. I want to play. A it good looks one. cool, man. Looks cool. Even Mario looks cool. I know everyone's making fun of it because it, he's like basically he's in the city. Yeah, but I, I just don't want to play. It looks that, cool, man. dude. Like they showed glimpses of like other worlds. All right, how's beyond this, the how's city this gonna work? And I thought it looked pretty neat. So I feel like I gotta set off. You just gotta set off the middle, like the one in front of you. Yeah, that one. Because uh, it won't. It's not attached to those, right? No, but then I'm, oh, I know. I just have to hit both of them because right. then I gotta jump over. Oh, oh, that's it. That's yeah. fucking easy, dude. I'm I mean, I told, fucking... I, dude, what did I say? Oh my god! Oh, I, th I thought, I thought, I thought that would have been bad. Hey, hey, hey! Hey, Chris. Anyone who uh, who listens to us, any of you guys play ever play Little Big Planet? If you do, leave it in the comment section. But also, dude, I oh, spent, you got to like, put your levels out there. I spent months of my life making these levels on that game, dude. And if you guys play Little Big Planet, if you're fans, you should go look up my levels and tell me what you think. Cause, dude, that game was so it was so fun to make your own levels, dude. Yeah. They found a formula. Like, they gave you enough materials to where it felt uniquely yours. You know, it wasn't like you're just copying some... Oh, oh cool. that's cool. Yeah. It's a fucking game, It's not dude. like you're just taking pre-made pieces and putting them... I'm a greedy bastard. Know. Yeah, no, like, it, it's... The breadth and width of, like, the variety that I've seen people generate from that is fucking insane. It's crazy. Oh, no! Oh, I, do I have to just... Oh, oh I see, I see. I see. I got it, Chris. I got it. Oh. oh, wait. Oh, yeah. Okay. Look at that. Look at this. I'm a gamer, Chris. I'm a gamer. <laughs> <laughs> You're barely <laughs> a gamer, Rod. You're barely a gamer. Except that I guess gamer. who's still alive right oh. now. Oh, and then you have to. Except oh, guess who's wow, alive wee. right now. That is not easy. Wow, wow, we, wow. Wow, wow, we, wow, wow, we. Dude, my son repeats me when I say wow, we. It's so adorable. <laughs> wow, we. He's like, wow, we. <gasps> oh no! I no, saw no. it. Saw it with my own eyes, man. It's uh, so, right, dude. You're gonna do it. <clears throat> you're making progress, and that's what matters, I'm, man. I'm glad you're a supportive partner. Yeah. Please. Sometimes. Oh. 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 Cool. Those are like the fire demons. Chris, uh, What's up, what are man? your plans What's for um, what are your New Year's resolutions? Even though it's February. I don't have any, man. My life's fucking perfect, bro. I don't have to change anything about my life. What are yours? Uh, we, what, what, what are like the first 10? Just give me the first 15, 20 um, things that the, you're going to try to do to make your life not shitty. The, oh, fuck. I just, <laughs> oh! The first, I mean, it's pretty much the same as last year's, which is... Uh, do the exact same shit because I have zero regrets from 2016. Hey man, yep. that's a good thing to be able to say. Yep. It's I don't good. really have any resolutions. Maybe just like not don't get divorced. Maybe. <laughs> that's it. That's one. a good one. Yeah. That's a good one. Um. Yeah, I don't want to get divorced either, even though I'm not married. You gotta get married first, brother. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I can keep that. How one. How's that going? Is, uh, your, is your mom always like when? No, actually, she's not. Yeah. Cause my mom's cool, man. That's cool. <laughs> Wish my mom was cool. Did she actually put pressure on you? Did it's your mom good. do that? I mean, not not real pressure, but she oh. would always ask. Well, that's good, cause she probably just wanted you to pop out a, a little a little Chris, wee, which you a did. Wee, a wee child. Was she like, I well done indeed. after after you seated? Yeah, uh, she was like Lindsay in here. Like, Level come match complete. <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> 
She said something clever, okay? All right, what are you going to do here, dude? What are you going to do? I do this, and I'm like, psych, and then I get hit, and then I'm like, fuck you. Oh, red I'm guy gone. got And I hit a checkpoint. Lava. Oh, whoa, look at this bastard. Oh, dang, dude. That guy's cool. no joke. I like, that guy's cool, man. Yeah. I'd hang out with him. Shit. Oh, goodness. Ah, this is where those come in handy, right? Dead. Ha, 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 ha. killed him dead. Good job, Rod. Did I tell you uh, that you was... killed him so hard, you slowed you, the game down. You haven't met uh, Chris O'Neill, but I remember the first time I met... Or not the first time, but one of the first times I was hanging out with him. I was like, oh, we should watch a movie or something. Like, what? Ooh, I'm going to get yeah, this first. good call. Good call! I was like, what, uh, what movie would we, he probably enjoy? I was like, oh, man, have you seen Kung Pao? And he's like, no. I'm like, okay, dude. We got to watch Kung Pao. And Tell me he liked it. Oh, he did. Was, that's how I knew we were going to get along. You're like, okay, this guy's okay. Yeah. This guy's all right. We, I've been telling him, like, uh, I need to get him on the show. Is that? this death? It is death. Wow. <sighs> Maybe... All right, this well. This is stupid. Yeah, it's really stupid. Chris, look at how sleepy you are. I know, man. All it's right, well, we, we got four nice. more minutes for today's recording, so we're going to we're, we're we're gonna we, have to be creative for the last four about? minutes. What are we talking about? How well, the world's going to end? Cause why is it going to end, Chris? The country is so divided? Yeah, you know, I think it's silly. I think people... The problem is that people are not listening to the other side. Fuck it. I'm just going to fucking kill myself. Um... Yeah. People just need to fucking listen to both sides of everything, man. But people aren't doing that. I think the worst thing that could happen is that people would... would that eventually, this will all die down and we'll all just go back to, like, complaining, but not really... Like, I, I see this as an opportunity for us all to come together under this idea that uh, both sides are bullshit. Uh-huh. Trump won, but look at who we had to choose from. Donald Trump and Hillary Clinton. Yeah. Like... People were so disenfranchised by modern politics in America that we would literally take any non-politician you gave us, even Donald Trump. Like, to me, that's that's what the, that's why he won. That's what this election was about. People are just tired well, of the government not doing what this what they say they're gonna do. The politicians. Yeah, I mean, you know what's funny too is like I, 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 there's also feel a certain faction of America also yes. was kind of tired of some of the uh, overly politically correct nonsense that people are mm-hmm. freaking out over, and right. it's interesting now because it's like they dug their own grave. The so, but the SJWs, oh shit, you know. the thing the thing that's weird is that like there are people who who are still shoveling some of this crap, even though, like, Mm -hmm. Trump's the president now. Like, I thought that would sort of be a motivator to shut the fuck up about, like, things that don't matter. You know what I mean? Like, everyone was, like, pissing their pants over stuff that was not a big deal. And then a lot of Americans were like, oh, yeah, well, there's enough of that. And then after the fact, after the the (laughs) devil is, or to to some people, is in the White House, they're like, do you know what's wrong with the world? White cis males. Like, they they just don't shut the fuck up about it. I'm like... Why you, why you keep going down this path? This is not going to help mm-hmm. at all. It's just not helping. It's just splitting people up. You just get you're just drawing lines. It's not Dude, good. Someone posted a pretty hilarious tweet, which was like some some. I don't know if this person was prominent or not, but it was very heavily retweeted on on Twitter. But the tweet was basically like, here here's the thing. Um, I I I I get the sense that if Hillary Clinton uh, loses, her supporters will be will be sad. If Donald Trump loses, his supporters will be angry. Uh, ha, Important ha, ha. distinction. Uh, ha, ha, ha. And you look at that now, uh, and it's ha, like ha. unbelievable. Yeah. Dude. Like, yeah, it could not be more the opposite. You know, I, I've heard that this this Generation Z right now is actually the most conservative generation we've had since uh, World War II. Like, like the these, younger generation? yeah, like high school kids oh, really? and everyone, because they've they've they're all online. They read everything, right. and they're starting to see all the bullshit of like the PC gen and like the millennials, right? Right. Like that, a lot of that stuff is garbage, and like thankfully now we have access to a lot of information, and right. yeah, they're they're it's a different generation, man, coming up. Dude, you know who Milo? Yeah, 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 yeah I know is. that guy. My brother is in one of his videos. Oh, weird. Because he was getting 
Because my brother Ben is like, he's a poli sci guy. He's way into politics, and he's uh oh, he's liberal. I'm sorry, he's super he's left. A, yeah. No, he's he's uh, super conservative. Oh, super conservative. And, Interesting. And he's black. He's was born in Ethiopia, uh-huh. and so he's getting screamed at by these protesters. Like, how can you be black and be with Trump's supporter? What? I want to see this now. We'll like, put that. We'll have to put a link. Yeah, yeah, it, I'll, yeah. We'll put it up. It's it's interesting to, to see. Like he, it's it's nuts, dude. Like passions were flaring for sure. That's crazy. He's a smart kid. Like really well read, and you know he's devoted much of his life to politics. And you know he's young, but he's he's he knows that's what he wants to do. And that's awesome. I don't know. I, I guess, but I I need, I need to say this out loud though that like when I talk about politics and 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 like quoting that tweet just now. You guys need to know that I'm not necessarily a Trump's. I'm not a conservative. I'm not. Uh-huh. I'm not anything. I'm not left. I'm not right. I, I think we need to get away from that two party, like any kind of allegiance to any kind of party. I think we got to get away from that. That uh-huh. is the problem. Party. The parties have become. It was predicted like back in the '80s that or earlier that politicians. How did you were, fucking deal with this section, whoa. by the way? Holy shit! I guess I just have to use the invincibility thing. Oh, yeah. The politicians would become kind of like celebrities. I think that's where we're at, man. Oh, yeah, no. Parties are just like... Obama started the whole uh, political celebrity thing hard, you know what I mean? And then Trump's just doing... He's just carrying it forward. Right. This is ridiculous. It's ridiculous. Ridiculous. This is fucking hard. At least they got him down to three. You almost had him. You got him down to three, at least. Just know that... I just want... The people in the middle to get what they want, because they're the ones that are... The most rational. Yeah. Sure. Everyone yeah. wants the same shit, dude. We just need politicians who who represent us. That's all we need. Yep. You, Rod, you. Thanks, man. You want to be I the governor of, Cal- of, of California? I would never I would never want to be in politics, dude. dude. Holy either. shit. I would that'd be the last thing I'd ever want to do. You have to like sell your soul. Okay, so that's a better way to handle that situation. I kept trying to attack him head on. And this is... Oh, my God. That's tricky. I I think I see the difference in that one. Whoa. Oh, my God. Nice. Hoya! 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 See, I'm warmed up now. I'm like a little... I'm like a little heated sausage. I'm ready for this. A sausage? (laughs) Come at me, bro. Come at me, bro. Come at him, bro. That's right. Okay, it's going to be the middle one. But the thing is, it's like... Does oh, that really you, help me? Cause I, wonder if you, I wonder if you can dig oh, it. Oh, you're right. You know you're totally right. Him? When you're right, you're right, Chris. I know. And that's when you're like right, you're right. Most of the time. You know. It's like usually. You know. Whoa. What the hell? Oh, my. Oh, fuck you, dude. Fuck you, dude. Come on, oh, dude. Oh, I want to say something right now, but you're in the mo- moment, so just, just win. Okay. Ha, I got his ass. Oh! One more, one more. Yeah! Yeah! I've never seen such a boss get killed. Eat a dick. Oh, my. Rod, how long has it been since we've done that? You remember that? Sing the eat a dick song? No, uh, oh, my. Oh, I'm, I'm Howard Hughes. <laughs> or what's his name? Huel uh, Hauser. Huel Hauser. Oh, well, that's my. just the most daring. That boss was throwing dirt. He was shooting dude, fire. Dude, we used to do that all the shooting time on this thing, dude. Right out of his head. I completely forgot about that. Man, rest in peace. Yeah. That guy was no, awesome. No, we're, bring, we're bringing that back, dude. No, we got to keep the spirit yeah. of, of Huel alive, for sure. He'll live on through TNGG. Well, guys, thanks for sticking with us. Yeah, you guys are uh, awesome. We'll be back, and then we'll just, like, play games. Keep and, playing. And, yeah. 